just put aside all the fanfare around image, video, audio models. When you see models like this Tahoo X1, that is the real use case for AI. This new model, which is a 3 billion parameter single cell foundation model, redefines the open biology with respect to artificial intelligence. In this video, I am going to tell you all about this model, its use case, and I believe this is ushering a new era when it comes to using AI, especially the generative AI, for scientific purposes. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Please like the video and subscribe and consider becoming a member as that helps a lot. So what exactly has happened here? Tahoe X1 is a large scale biological foundation model developed by Tahoe Bio. It's trained on massive single cell data sets, millions and millions of gene expression profiles to learn unified representations of genes, cells and drugs. Think of it like a language model, but instead of learning words and sentences, it learns the language of life, which means how genes express, interact and change under different conditions like drug treatment or genetic mutations. The goal here is to help scientists understand and predict cellular behavior, which genes are essential for survival, how diseases change cellular programs and how cells respond to drugs. Tahoe X1 acts as a general purpose model that can be applied across biological problems from drug discovery to functional genomics. You can even install it very very quickly locally and you could just follow the transformers library but of course it's a very special purpose model you would need some proper uh, genes files which I don't have otherwise I could have shown you the installation but if you want I can also send you the code if you're interested or you could send me the genes file and I could show you the real-time demo but anyway let's do even better than that let's try to do um, a deep dive into the model which will give us a real insight as how cool uh, the work they have done so if you look at this image this shows you how the model's architecture evolved and it's fairly interesting each box here represents a transformer block the same family of neural networks used in every other model out there if you look at the first panel, it shows the early design where the model separates self-attention and cross-attention, meaning it looks at how genes interact with each other and how they relate to output predictions. If you look at the center panel, it shows an improved version where it has integrated both into a single optimized attention layer using Triton kernels and the last panel presents the final version, which is a dense attention architecture using flash attention V2, which makes the computation faster and more memory efficient. The small boxes below show how the model takes gene tokens like gene A, gene B, gene C, along with their expression level represented as numbers such as 2, 1, 14, and these are the model's input units, much like words and their meanings in language models, or you can say these are the tokens. This image shows one of Tahoe's main applications which is to determine which genes are essential for a cell's survival and that in my opinion is the best thing which this model is doing for example in if you look at this crispr knockout screen scientists turn off specific genes and observe whether cell die or keep growing tahoe x1 learns from these experiments and predict gene essentiality computationally without the need for physical screening and the bar chart simply is telling us how well the model performs with orange bars reaching much higher AROC and AUPRC scores than other models, which simply means it predicts essential genes with strong accuracy. This is another um, very cool image which shows you how this model understands biological programs such as hallmarks of cancer. Each colored slice represents a biological process like evading uh, apoptosis, sustaining something angiogenesis or tissue invasion. This model can predict which genes belong to these hallmark pathways by analyzing expression data. The model captures these subtle relationships which help researchers interpret what functional roles certain genes might play. So fairly interesting. In my opinion, 
now this is telling you uh, that how this model focuses on drug response prediction this model was trained on the large Tahoe 100 million data set which includes cell treated with hundreds of chemical compounds. The model can generalize from very very few examples known as few short learning and on the right you can see that the performance close to experimental noise ceiling. This one highlights zero short learning the, which is primarily the ability to predict cellular responses to entirely new stimuli that the model never saw during a training. And they have shared all the training data, all the detail in their repo, which I will drop the link in video's description. So look, I'm very, very excited as you might probably already guess that this model is what makes AI so useful because this model represents a major step towards foundation model for biology. It learns the underlying structure of cellular systems, which really makes it possible to predict gene function, drug effect, and disease-related patterns, all from raw single cell data. And by combining modern AI scal scaling methods with biological insights, Tahu Bio has built a model that doesn't just analyze biological data, it begins to understand it. And that offers the foundation for the next generation of data-driven discoveries in genomics, precision medicine and drug development and that is where what makes it so so enticing now if you're looking to install it let me give you a very quick uh, rundown so all you need to do is to git clone the repo and you can find the link in video's description from there just install this can be and this is these are the few lines which you can use in order to generate the embeddings and uh, these are some of the file formats as you can see and i'll be honest i have no clue what that means but i'll just go with the flow there is also a docker installation if you're interested and they have a lot of stuff around clustering tu tutorial and you can even fine tune this on your own use case and they have shared the whole notebook if you are interested in that also you can you know create the configuration files like repo id and then there is advanced usage which of course if you are belong to that field you can read through and maybe you know also educate us in the comments so all in all i think wonderful wonderful work um, i mean i'm happy to you know um, you know deal more with it if you're interested i'm even willing to install it for you just uh, you know for free no charges at all also, if you're looking to build an AI project for any business purposes, I have recently started a consultancy. Um, I have my own team. So if you're interested, I can build the whole project for you. Uh, we already have built numerous projects for various clients across the globe. Um, just email me. My email is also given here on the channel's homepage. Just click on read more and reach out. Happy to help out. That's it. Please like the video, subscribe and consider becoming a member as that helps a lot. Thank you for all the support.